Let's talk about how to solve or evaluate expressions with negative exponents. So what is the value of 2 raised to the negative 3? 2 to the negative 3, let's put this over 1. This is equal to something that you're allowed to do is if you move the 2 from the top of the fraction to the bottom, the exponent will change sign. So this is equivalent to 1 over 2 raised to the third power. So that's how you can convert a negative exponent to a positive exponent. You simply flip the fraction or move the base to the other side of the fraction. 2 to the third is 2 times 2 times 2. We're multiplying three twos, and that's equal to 8. So 2 to the negative 3 is 1 over 8. In contrast, 2 to the third is 8. So when you have a negative exponent, you just basically flip it over 1. Or in this case, flip it under 1. Now what about 4 to the negative 2? Well, let's move the 4 to the bottom of the fraction. This is equivalent to 1 over 4 squared. 4 squared is 4 times 4. 4 times 4 is 16. So 4 to the negative 2 is 1 over 16. Let's try two more examples. Go ahead and try these two examples. 3 to the negative 3 and 5 raised to the negative 2. So we can write this as 1 over 3 to the positive 3. And 3 cubed is 3 times 3 times 3. 3 times 3 is 9 times another 3, that's 27. So the answer is going to be 1 over 27. For 5 to the negative 2, this is 1 over 5 squared. 5 squared is 5 times 5. 5 times 5 is 25. So that's going to be the answer, 1 over 25.